Hey guys, what's going on? It is the big day. We got the Mayuri, Genjo, and Tsukushima summons today. And this is going to be pretty big. So they're doing more than just guaranteed 5 star at step 5 and step 10, but also at other, every other subsequent 5 step up to like 30, step 30 or something. So um, the fact they're doing that means they know people are going to be summoning on this big time. And uh, as for me, I'm not huge into PvP right now. I'm pretty lax on it. So we're just going to... We, we have enough... 1,121 orbs, that's enough to get us to step 5, so <clears throat> we'll just see how our luck goes, and hopefully we'll get a banner character. We do have 10 Brave Soul summons tickets to use, and that's it, so we're going to be doing uh, steps 1 through 5, and it would be nice to get Tsukushima, I'm, I don't think we're going to get him. I mean, some of y'all may, if you're going to be summoning, but if you want a solid PvP unit and you're like a beginner or kind of intermediate player, uh, Tsukushima is the way to go. So, yeah, he's a must-have. He also has boost, um, stat boost attack, in addition to the invincibility and all that good stuff. So, he's pretty insane. Poise, flurry, all that good stuff. So, yeah, he's, he's pretty, pretty awesome. Mayuri would be pretty fun, because he, he uses the corpse unit in his attacks. And he's a strong attack, and I'm, I'm kind of a fan for strong attacks. But the filler pool, I'm actually liking the filler pool. Um, it'd be so awesome to get that Grimjow. He is probably one of the coolest looking characters in the game, next to the, the third anniversary Ukiora. And the Hikone, the newer Hikone, not that orange one. But it'd be nice to get dupes of the orange Hikone, too. And so I don't have the Grimjow and the three banners, so that's four. And uh, I have everybody else. So it'd be cool to get dupes of that, that, um, Retsu. The purple one. She's a really cool special move animation. But we'll just have to see. Um, it's always... You never know what you're going to get, really. And I think, is it... What's the... It doesn't tell you double chance. What are they doing for the percent chance of getting a 5-star? That's kind of the important part. Okay, good. They're doing 6%. I was like, maybe they're trying to trick us by, by not putting it on the main page. Um... Maybe it's on this page. Yeah, it is. There it is. Okay. You just had to go over a thing. All right. Step one. Here we go. Tsukushima is... Yes. And then Mayuri would be good. But... You're not always guaranteed one. Just like that. We got a four star. That's an example of... Uh, you don't always get beginner's luck. And uh, let's... I'll wait till we're about halfway to do the Brave Soul. Step two. Here we go. So at least we're coming out of this with one five star. Oh, oh my gosh. What? On one butterfly? Are you kidding me? Yeah, I don't get the first one. Oh, is that Gendro? Gendro? No, wait. It is. Oh, no. It's, it's a Kugo. Yeah. Awesome! Ginjo. Okay, that's what I was trying to say. Ginjo. Uh, whoa! We got a banner! That's exciting. So, he he's he's good for PvP too, but not as good as Tsukushima. But, that's a pretty sick... I like that little purple animation going on. Because I was getting tired of just the, the gray background, so I'm glad they put some animation in there. Awesome! We got... Hey! We got Kugo. That's pretty cool. I, I can tell you that there are going to be people out there on this game who will not be able to say that they even got any banner character. Period. So, you know, be happy with what you get. And I'll be happy I got Kugo, the newer one. That's exciting. Though I'm wondering why they made Tsukushima the 
the invincible skill person. Maybe Kugo would have made more sense. Because he's the more attack-oriented person. Like, Tsukushima, it doesn't make much sense why you'd make him as the normal attack build, but... Hey, because, I mean, he's spiritual pressure. He's not, like, a powerhouse like Kenpachi or, uh... Which is face? The fifth Espada. Sweet! Alright, so let's take a look. Kugo was found by Kukaku, who brought him to live at the Shiba residence. When he hears rumors of a new religious group called Execution, gaining power in the world of the living, he throws himself into the commotion and confronts his true enemy, Tokunada Suniyashiro. And if y'all haven't already, play the story mode. Uh, it's pretty awesome what's going on in the story mode. You can see how he is involved with the, the story and what he does. But awesome! Hey, we got, we got a banner. Cool. And let's go ahead and do step three, and then we will do the Brave Soul uh, summons tickets. I couldn't believe we got the I reject on one butterfly. Normally I don't see that. <clears throat> Alright. Ten Brave Soul Summon tickets. Here we go. I hope y'all are getting good luck. And I hope you get who you want. Tsukushima, maybe. If you're, oh, I reject? Yeah! See? Okay, with three, three butterflies, it seems to do it. Who is that? Senbon Zakura. Kageyoshi. Cool. We got two five stars, so we're coming out of this with three, because step five is guaranteed. So, uh, hey, that's pretty good. That's that's very good. Now, I don't think I'm, I'm going to be using him, but I'll, I'll figure that stuff out after the video. Because I may sell him for transcendence points to do extra stat boost rerolls, but we'll just have to see. We will just have to see. Yeah, I can already hear it now. There are going to be people who are so mad that they didn't get Tsukushima, and they're, they're going to quit the game, and they're going to uninstall the game from their phone because they're going to be salty. So, you know, I mean... There are going to be people who will not be happy, but be happy with what you get. If you get anything, even if it's not the bed. Oh, okay. Man, see, that was three butterflies, and that just came out to be a four-star. So, one multi had... Uh, so, out of the... F almost... We're about to do step five. The first two were four-stars... Step three was a five star. Step four, four stars. So three of the steps have been four stars and one five stars. So majority have been four stars. And uh, here we go. Without further ado, we have the guaranteed five star. Let's hope it's good. Oh no! No, Yorichi, I don't care about you. Where do you have her max transcended? Oh my gosh, another one? <gasps> another Kugo? Genjo, what the heck? What? Another one? Why? <sighs> oh, well, that's good. Okay, well, we've come out of this with Simon Zakura. We got a Kugo, and we got another Kugo. So, uh, hey, that's good. And, and we got the, uh, Yorodichi, so, that's, was that four five-star characters? So, that's, I guess that balances it out, I suppose. Kaname. Hmm. I'm curious how many people got Kugo. I want to take a look at his skill set after this. Just out of curiosity again. I only watched their gameplay for uh, 
a little bit. Um, and let me see what he has. I don't think it's anything super special. Normal attack, 25%. Bruiser, 40. Berserker, 50. Bruiser, or Bruiser, one of them's a normal attack. Flurry, he doesn't have poise. He has follow-up. What does follow-up do? That's a new thing. Follow-up allows the character to cause damage to prone opponents. See, that's the thing. I'm like, what does prone opponents mean? Does that mean if they are in, you know, if they're in survival uh, rate thing and they're coming back to life, do you kill them while they're knocked down kind of thing? Like, that wouldn't make much sense because that would override the survival thing. It, it would kill them before they get revived, basically. I mean, that would be weird. But that's the only thing I could think it's prone means when you're flat. You know, if you're in the Call of Duty, you go prone. You're, you're on your belly. You're in plank. So, I guess that's what that means, I suppose. Guard break, that's good. He'd be good for PV, uh, like player versus everyone as well. Devastation, weakened defense. Yeah, I guess he's okay. But, all right, well, hey, we got we got a banner character, so we're going to take it, take it and go. But um, best of luck to y'all. And if that's anything, remember, this is Simrovia, and I'll talk to you next time. Ciao.